Hello guys, welcome. You are watching Technology Welfare. Let's learn and watch with practical in this video tutorial. How to downgrade or download iOS on your any iPhone device without data loss. So if you don't want to lose any data, how do you downgrade any iOS? So firstly, let's check it out. What's currently iOS is working on this device. So, for instance, I have taken this. So, I will tap on a setting. In setting, just I will go in a general. So, we will tap on a general. After tapping on a general, we will click on a software update. So, tap on it. So, it has started to check it out, and it's saying that up to that. So, up to that. So, we don't have a choice to go back or downgrade iOS, but of course we can. So, how do you do that? For it, guys, here we need to open a 3 or 12 guys, and connect to your data cable. So, iPhone should be connected or connect to your iPhone device with the help of data cable from iPhone to, of course, PC or laptops. And here, we will click on a refresh and uh, then we will click on a after refreshing we will click on a smart flash guys see here we have a uh, four choice one is a uh, if you would like to go back from 16 to 15 of course we can go by selection this 15.6.1 or 15.7 so right now see guys here we have a uh, two choice anyone we will select we will start to a download here so see it will start to a download but of course internet connection is not good one right now so that's why it's in a pending but of course it will download and after downloading if you don't want to lose your data go with retain user data guys so all the data it's an application will be remain on your device and only one iOS will be dwindled or of course downgraded. Second we have a C here quick flash mode. Don't go with that, otherwise you can lose your data. And anti recovery flash, don't go with that because your data won't be recovered. And here fix a flash. If you're having any error on your iOS device related to iOS or IPSW, go with this option it will be fixed quickly so after selection this one we will go for retain user data and I will click on a flash option so here we have a choice to backup so see guys it's a saying that if you did not backup then whatever recently or of course uh, uh, whatever data that you have recorded yeah, any data that you have kept in your iPhone and of course it hasn't been the rest on iCloud so go for backup it so if you lose there, then of course you can back up that data after because this 3 or 12 will reserve. So before that you can go if you have latest recently backed, then of course uh, directly go for flash. So you will click on there. You can bypass the backup and of course within a 5 to 10 minutes it will be of course downgraded your iOS. So this is all about in this video tutorial guys because uh, live actually we are not in a position to show you because uh, internet quality is uh, frequently very low so that's why especially. So this is all about in this video tutorial. Furthermore any inquiry of course blindly you can have the query below the comment box. I will reply as soon as possible according to your query guys. So thank you. Thank you very much indeed. Have a great time guys. See here guys, we don't, we cannot go, especially, I'm sorry, uh, we cannot go back manually with the help of iPhone, but with the help of computer, of course you can. So download link, this tool, of course I will give you below the description box, it's a free of course, so you can, I have. So thank you once again.